In this quick video guide, we're going to see how we can download, install, and run Rhino 8, which is a computer graphics software used for 3D modeling and can create pretty complex uh, shapes and surfaces. And of course, if you look uh, in the web, you're going to have more information if you're interested. And there are other courses and video guides in the channel explaining you a lot of uh, Rhino features, but um, this is just to show you how we can download install this tool. So you, uh, Rhino works with NURBS, which means non-uniform uh, rational B-splines, and it creates this type of models, which are based on curves and then on surfaces, and then it creates really complex 3D models that can be printed or can be used as prototype or can be rendered and use as concept design, et cetera, et cetera. So you can create like straight edges, but also really soft shapes. And it's pretty versatile. And of course, uh, it's going to add more and more features. This is the last version. So it's um, ha having a lot of uh, improvements in terms of renderings and mapping, et cetera, et cetera. So I'm just going to type here a uh, trial. So you, you can use the version for 90 days for free. So uh, Rhino 8 trial is completely free and you can only use it for an evaluation period of 90 days as is written right here. And when you're finished, you can decide if you want to continue to use it, you cannot save or use other plugins and other like additional tools, but you can still use it for purposes of learning or you know trying it out. Or, and then you have also offers for students and um, teachers, et cetera, et cetera. So you have many options, but we're going to go for the trial version here. So I'm going to go, and if I, if I want to reach the fastest way possible, I just type Rhino downloads, and I'm going to get in the download page. Now, I'm sorry this is in Italian, but it's really easy to understand. This is just where I can download either for Windows or for Mac. And down at the top here, you, you can find the 90 days complete version. I want to specify that this is a complete version. So you can do basically anything that you can do with the like uh, final version or commercial version, but just for 90 days. That's the only limit you have. For everything else, uh, you know, it's pretty fine and so um, okay so after 90 days you can still use it for learning and for visualizing 3d models made in Rhino and this is the system requirements if you want to have a look to the hardware that you need but uh, Rhino doesn't require like so powerful machines to use it now this red button here is to click and access your account or create one. So if you have an account, you can access with an email or with Google. And if you do not have an account, you need to create a new one, just inserting your name, email. And once you do that, I logged in with my Google account. You can just click. And once you finish this uh, login part or registration part you can download. I'm downloading the US version and also the Italian version, but uh, in the options you can uh, insert or like um, install more than one language. So uh, once you finish to download, you will find the file inside your download folder. Just double click on the file to run the installation. It's going to be a pretty, well, not, not too big, but Kind of a big file and here you can select the languages this is the the installation screen and you have the possibility to get into the settings if you click on the little engine icon and once you're here you can choose a different license you can uh, choose uh, more languages you can choose the directory where you want to install it and you could choose if you want like updates automatic updates and stuff like that and you can also download everything for the offline installation. But I'm just going to click on this red button, which is going to let me install Rhino. So to recap, you need to have an email uh, associated. You need to receive your license code, or uh, you can use that license code 
that you receive on the email or you can use directly the email and you download the installation file exe you double click you insert all the information you want you, you do the initial settings and then you just wait for the software to be installed and the final packages to be downloaded and there it is so once it's finished i'm gonna close this double click on this uh, shortcut icon that should appear on your desktop if it doesn't just look for the software inside your computer and just run so double click to run it and it could ask you for again the access or login into your area so once you double click this you may be prompt onto a web page like this so you log in again insert your license insert your email once you finish you will be successfully logged in and so you can use the software so just gonna double click again and so and now sh I should be ready and there you go now you can see loading the various interfaces and this is the software itself and it presents like this this is again the version 8 and um, what I'm gonna do is go to file and this is in Italian so if I go to file properties I can go to the Rhino options and look for the appearance tab so this one here is for the appearance and here is where I can change languages so you can see I've installed it English and Italian and now I can say okay I need to restart the software to make the changes effective so um, also here this little engine here icon at the top can be used to access the options and to change uh, many things right now I'm just changing the language and I restarted the software you can see now it's in English and it's going to tell me how many days are left uh, the, at the top and then um, here I have the properties on the file I can click the little engine there with the left mouse and get in the properties again so again Reno options appearance and this is where I can change the language and among many other things and if I expand this I can also go and change the color so if you don't like this dark screen you can go to the like uh, classic light or you can also customize it furthermore so you can choose light or dark I'm gonna go for dark because I think it's more relaxing for the eyes and say okay and that's it and if I want to change the language again I need to restart again but I'm gonna stop right now for this video I hope you enjoy it if you did please subscribe to the channel to stay updated for more videos like this or, or also on other software and also if you want to thank us support us please join the channel as a supporter go and check our other video courses and video guys that are already in the channel see you in the next video